Um, we expect it to be a, a comedy movie, a light-hearted sort of movie, and you know, the regular thing, a few laughs, a few jokes, and a typical Hindi movie. I, I, she might be a bigger fan than me. I am his yeah. fan, not him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but he's good. The last couple of movies have done pretty well, so I have expectations out of this one. I'm actually, I wasn't actually a fan, but after watching a couple of his films, like Wake Up, Sid and the Lights, I've been, I'm really impressed by his, his professionalism. Oh yeah, Savaria was the initial film which I wasn't impressed by. Uh, since then, I, I, I wasn't really expecting much from him. But then a couple of his previous films has been like really, really good. Wake Up Sid? Wake Up Sid, one of them. I, I found a really good parallel to that film. So I'm really, really appreciative of that movie. I mean, th that was one of the big films that that you know that crossed over in Bollywood by a director that was com coming from abroad. I mean, Shamit Amin, he really, that, that was an excellent film. That was one film which I was actually impressed by Shah Rukh Khan. I'm not a big fan of Shah Rukh Khan actually, unlike a lot of people, contrary to popular belief, but since uh, Chuck De India, I'm like, I knew that, I know for finally that Shah Rukh Khan can actually act. I'm uh, uh, seeing the trailers, I'm, I'm actually expecting a lot from Rocket Singh because uh, the trailers is really, really impressive and really funny. And that's the only reason I'm actually here, to actually watch Rocket Singh at the premiere with Ranbir Kapoor. So let's make it happen. You know, I'm first time in Dubai, first time in this festival, and I wish to come here very strongly. You know, because um, it's new one, it's only sixth edition of festival, and surely I was interested to see films focused on region. And you know, we are looking maybe, I, mean, I saw three films, and what I understand, I understand that Dubai, as I, as I feel it, it's a rich country and it's self-sufficient country. But and, uh, and uh, in, in, inside, I expected that it will be like commercial films, easy about easy life, about rich men, women, and so on and so on. But what, what, what I like very much is that films are focused on the problems of the region. We saw Palestinian films, and it's so. It's the problem shown of Palestine. We show Kurdish film, Iraqi film, and it's also about problems. And in general, it seems that festival try to focus on the pains of the region, because it's absolutely impossible that one country will be rich and good, and neighbors will be poor and unhappy. And uh, I very respect this position of the country. And. Um, Surely I want to see more films and surely I want to invite the best films to our festival also from the region because you know we are Muslim country, Kazakhstan, and we feel very close to the problems in the, this Arabic Asia region. And uh, what we have, we have news, we have knowledge from news, but news it's not a deep understanding of the region. And uh, for me it's very important coming to here because I feel that it's not only news on TV, it's more deep problem.